this is why I don't like doing customer care and then cups of tea and stuff in my car. Now look what I've done. I've got no over here, no nothing. Jesus Christ, what a shitter. What are we going to do with that? Right then, as a new build house painter, one of the things we hate doing is snagging plots. Because it gets worse and it gets worse and there is more and more. And what you think is going to take a day takes two days to snag. It's a nightmare. And I was talking to somebody not long ago. And he rang me up out of the blue. Not heard from him for about a year. So basically I answered the phone and I said, what do you want? Because obviously you want something, don't you? So... Um, he goes, oh yeah, I'm painting on this firm, I'm getting sick and tired of it, keep giving me day work and all the rest of it. I said, well, you're living in cloud cuckoo land if you think you're going to, you know, carry on painting and, and not have to do any day work. You can't just go from plot to plot to plot, it just don't work like that. I thought, up on cloud nine, you are, aren't you? No. Hey. But anyway, the story behind the slobber is... I'm just finishing the week off because I've had a couple of days off this week and um, doing a bit of snagging. Although I thought it was snagging, it's not. It's customer care. So I've got today, Thursday, and I've got Friday to do it as well. And a lot of things that are happening now on new build sites is they're getting a professional snaggering, aren't they? To rip it to bits. Not just the painting, everything. And I heard down the grapevine, they were charging like 500 quid to do this. I thought, that's a good number, isn't it? Yeah, you're easy to get it done in a day, isn't you? It's not hard, is it, to rip somebody else's work to bits, let's face it. And um, so I come into this and I've got a, a, I've got a book to work to on the snagging. I'm not joking, it, it, it's got to be about five mil thick with all little photos and describing what it's got to be done and the photos are about an inch square and you've got little red circles on that you're expected to see where where the snag is do you know what i mean which you can't you've got to guess so i'm doing this customer care luckily the customer's not here i've seen him today though and um I've had a bit of a brainwave. I have. Because, you know, I, I'm, I'm getting to my mature years now. <laughs> and I'm getting sick and tired of painting these new build plots for other people and getting paid peanuts from. Because it's getting worse. You, you're getting paid less um, to paint them. And it, it's doing me head in. You, you just can't make your money. You're grafting like hell. And if you don't spray, you... you you're going to struggle to make them pay. I'll tell you now. You really are making. You you really are going to struggle to make them pay. Yeah, I've had a bit of a brainwave. Because customers here, and I'm doing this um, snag. It's a snag from um, a professional snagger, as you would call. So I've got the paper, all the photos, what one's doing, etc., etc. Not very clear. I would do it a different way. Um, so there it is. I would do it a different way. Mm. So I'm thinking to myself, well, I could do this professional snagging. Can I? It's not hard, is it? But I'd only do it on the painting side. All I would do is um, professional painting snag on new build houses. That's what I do. I, I want because a lot of them on the sheet that I've got, it's got other bits and bobs on it. Not a massive amount. It's picked up other stuff, but not a massive amount. Um, and ninety-five percent of it, or ninety percent, is painter snags. Well, anybody can do that, can't they? 
and anybody could do that and get paid what they're getting paid for it. So I asked this customer, I said, if you don't mind me asking, how much did you pay for this professional snag up? He goes, oh, 350 quid. I thought, oh my God. Right, I said, okay. So I says, and then he says, oh, he, he's, he's got to come back and check it once it's done. I said, uh, do you have to pay for that? He goes, yeah, yeah, I've got to pay for that. I thought, well, I'm not going to ask you, do you know what I mean? Because I've known professional snaggers charge about 500 quid to snag the plot out. Um, and I've never heard of them coming back to check it and all the rest of it. But I'm thinking I could do that and I could charge. I'd charge four or 500 quid just for the painting snag and I would rip it to bits. I kid you not, I would rip it to bits. But the way I'd do it is the way the agents do it. I would go around, right, find defects on, on, say, one wall, put them red stickers all over it where the defects are so the painter can find it, then take a photo of it, then use that photo on, on, on your, your, your paperwork, like, you know, um, multiple defects on um, bay window wall, left-hand side, C dots, etc., etc. I'd do that. I'd charge 500 quid for that. I'll tell you what, I would. And I said, uh, this bloke said to me, he goes, he goes, yeah, 350 quid, he says, isn't it? It's the best 350 quid I ever spent. And I thought, right. I thought, well, he ain't picked up half of it for a start. And, um, and it's, it's not over detailed, to be fair. Yeah, you know, it's just, it's just walked around, picked fault with it, wrote it down on their paper. It's all done professionally, like, you know what I mean? wrote it down and a photograph and that's it, send me the check before a start. So I, I think I think it could be the future. I might look into this. Whether you get any work or not, I don't know. And you, you could advertise and if you get one, just take like a day off work and go and do it. And then go home on your computer, send them all the details on email, print it all off. Jobs are good, isn't it? It's got to be easy and painting these shitty plots out for other people, isn't it? It's got to be. I think it's a way forward, I really do. I've never thought about it before. But I'm thinking about it now. Professional painting snagger in new, for new built properties. I tell you what, I could end up hiring somebody to give me an hand, couldn't I? I think it's a way forward. Because you, you imagine, you've, you've, you've only got to do two a week, haven't you? at 500 quid a piece. And that's a thousand pound, 800 pound in the bank after tax. And you could just rip them to bits. You know, I'd have red dots everywhere. Literally, everywhere. Mm. Don't tell anyone. Let me do it first. I'd, I'd do the whole Leicestershire, I would. It's a way forward. Can't believe no, it's better than painting a plot out all week, isn't it? Rushing around. And you don't make no money on them now, do you? If you don't spray, you're not making any money on these new build plots. Professional paint snag off and new build properties at your service. Ho <laughs> yeah, fighter! Can you imagine coming on a site where you know one of the blokes and he's a wanker as a painter? And you think, guess what? I'm gonna snag your plot out, mate. I'm gonna rip the shit out of it. What you'll say about that after you slag me off, etc. etc. Oh, I tell you what, people will be shaking in the boots when they know I'm doing professional snagging on the painting. Yeah, bite up. Well, watch this space, guys. Watch this space. It could happen. It could happen. You never know. Start off slow, wean me way in. Well, before we end this video. <laughs> there comes a time when you've exhausted all avenues in the painting videos so you have to venture out to near and far as they say you've got to have your fingers in all pies in this day and age you need to be making money whilst you're asleep. Like I do with the YouTube videos. 
I'm in the land of nod. And people still watching my videos, making me money. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you very much. Bank manager loves me, loves me. So, with the aspect of fingers all in all pies, watch this and tell me what you think. It's going to blow your mind. Oh, candle. Hello, mate. How are you? I tell you what, it's good to see a friendly face. <laughs> oh, let's see. Mm. Well, do I light up your life? Uh, level. It's not uh, rushed to die. And God said. Let there be light, and there was. As he gazes at the beacon in the distance, he makes a decision. Keep the flame burning, guys. Keep it burning. If he could become as tall and beautiful, oh, perhaps he too there. could illuminate the dark oh, night. The ship. Interesting. That's right. <laughs> That's right. Candleman game. What do you reckon? To that, it's just something else, isn't it? Absolutely, something else. There's just no end to me talents, no end. So, get yourself over to the App Store and buy Candleman Game for 4 99 or whatever it is. <sighs> Who would have thought, eh? Who would have thought? <laughs> I tell you, little candle running around in a shipwreck, lighting up his path, eh? So yeah, that, well that's about it guys, I mean where do you go from there, where do you go, a Candleman game on the App Store, get yourself over there and have a bash at it, it's good fun, also I might add, check out my other channel, CM Gaming, all the adventures of that game, captured in HD quality, or 4K quality, on my other channel, CM Gaming, and watch me go through all the levels of that game. Good fun, I tell you, good fun. You know it makes sense. Till next time, catch you later. You never know what's round the corner. <laughs>